Hi there, I'm Ekfa, and I'm going to show you these two circuits today. They're basically the same thing with different layouts. They are monostable circuits. They're exclusive to Bedrock, and these are the only uh, one-tick pulse limiters, uh, which are both one-wide and tileable and silent in Minecraft. You can only do that in Bedrock Edition. So um, they, they're typically called monostable circuits. They're a specific example of that because they're one-tick pulse limiters. And actually, a monostable circuit is anything that reverts back to a steady state. So it could come on and give you a pulse for three hours and then turn off would be a monostable circuit. Or even something that flashes several times, then goes off. It's also a monostable circuit. So these are one tick pulse limiters, and that's what we're going to look at today. OK, so let's dive straight in. I'm not going to show you how to build these. Because I think it's pretty obvious from um, just looking at it. What I will do is explain a little bit about how it works. So essentially the idea is on bedrock, when you power a piston, it can power a torch which is attached to it. So what's actually happening here is that this torch is powering both of these pistons and therefore these two torches are turned off by that. And I never want the pistons to move even though they're powered. So I've got the bedrock here, stop that uh, bedrock. Obsidian here, which is an immovable block. That stops the pistons from going anywhere. So let's have a quick demo. I'm going to put a, a lever here and we'll put a piston up here, which is, you know, it could be whatever we're driving with a circuit. When I turn the lever on, I get a one tick pulse at the top. And that's happening because when this torch goes off, it allows this torch to come on. It allows this torch to come on. But once this torch has come on, one tick later, it powers this piston again and turns this torch off. So it will only come on for one tick. Like that. And exactly the same over here. This is a more horizontal layout. So depending on what you're building, what fits into your area, um, this one might be better or that one. Exactly the same principle. This torch is powering both of these pistons, turning off both of these torches. And when it goes off, they will both come on, but once this one comes on, it'll turn this one off again one tick later. So there we go. And there you have it. That's two one tick pulse limiters or monostable circuits for Minecraft Bedrock Edition. So I just want to quickly say that, you know, I, I love Bedrock Edition. I love Minecraft. Um, I enjoy producing these videos and I hope you love them too. Um, I, I create lots of content which is exclusive to Bedrock using uh, mechanics which you know don't exist necessarily in Java edition. Um, so you know I hope that really helps out the community. And if you did enjoy this video, please think about uh, liking it and also subscribing to the channel so you can see more of my content and it helps other people to find it too. Okay, thank you very much. Take care.